and I, and we keep telling it, everyone's going to watch this, whether you, whether you want to farm or not, it's just life oh, yeah. in general. It really yeah. is. It's we're always looking for that quick fix. And most of the time that quick fix has such a disastrous long-term effect, but this yeah. is what's drilled in us every day. But instead of dwelling on that, we were just talking about before you came on here the beauty of possibly the future of what you're showing i think has so much potential to change human nature across the world i'm not just saying i'm not just saying that i don't need to say that you don't need to be here but that that was that's to me is the most i told uh margo the producer i was a zombie for a week and a half i was just i mean have you seen this movie? It's, oh, it's, what do you love about it? I went, no, you don't understand. It, it brings you back to everything's existence. And I, yeah. and I can't reiterate that enough. So. Thanks for saying that. You're, you, you it's put it you. out there. I'm just, yeah, I'm just acknowledging. It's, so it's in you. It's, in you. Can, can I, can I, it's, it's inside you. And I think that's what it is. So like, you, you know, your gut microbiome is a fractal representation of my farm. And my, this farm is a microcosm, a fractal, a fractal representation of the, the way the biosphere of the planet works. So your immune system in your body is regulated by a diverse assortment of microorganisms. And that actually is the regulating principle of your immune system. So there's all these different players in there that if you use excess amounts of antibiotics over your lifetime can kill some of those beneficial microorganisms that actually help your immune system, right? So then it throws off the chemistry in your body and then suddenly the pathogenic organisms can start to win because there isn't that special force that got wiped out through the collateral damage use of say antibiotics. It's the same with land, uh, with a farm and the entire regulating principle of the immune system of our planet are, is not just the soil system, which is only 12 inches. It's all the living creatures above that. They are regulating epidemic breakouts without us even knowing it. And when one keystone species disappears, like for example, the coyote, if we actually were able to eliminate the coyote, we would be overrun in my prediction by rabbits, gophers, voles, so many things and then the disease that would come from that we've been trying to extinguish and kill coyotes for over two centuries we kill five hundred thousand. and this isn't like don't kill coyotes campaign i'm just saying these are the consequences i'm not trying to be right. righteous here are the facts correct we try to kill we kill five hundred thousand coyotes a year and for some reason all that's done because this creature is so incredibly prolific all it's done is um uh, force them to spread throughout the country and it even increases pack sizes as we kill them and thank god because there's something that they're doing to regulate the whole system right. and so what i'm saying is is that the reason i feel people are connecting to this is because the, the film is a representation of the universe inside of you literally the scientific version of the universe inside of you existing on the outside in the microcosm of a farm that is the microcosm of the way the planet works as well. So it's this thread of connection that is like imprinted within you and reminds you that you are alive. Wow.